Alright, this is a unfamiliar screen to you guys. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna switch this over a little bit. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, she's very enthusiastic. Yes, she is. <laughs> We're fighting the forces of darkness. This is stage two. I don't know, what should I go with? Prime? Dash? 12 year old girl. 12 year old girl. Yes, stage two 12 year old girl. Okay, so the. The theory behind this is we're going around the back way. Wait, is she fighting with birds? Yes, uh, that's her main way of attacking, is she throws a maximum of two doves at her enemies. And she can attack while walking. So the she's birds. Like... Coming up. That is awesome. <laughs> and they're slightly weaker than the whip, but... It doesn't matter, because you can move while throwing them, and most enemies die in one hit from them. And also, I suppose you hit faster than the whip, because you fire two at a time? Yep. So basically, damage output is much better. Also, that's a gargoyle. That is a gargoyle. That's two gargoyles. That's two gargoyles. But they know better than to tangle with a 12-year-old anime girl. With True. birds. Killer birds. Oh, crap. Oh, wait. Oh. oh, this is nice. Huh. I guess we're gonna just take a ride then. Going down the river sticks. Yeah, pretty much. This is the ferryman. He returns in Symphony of the Night. Thy destiny awaits. I don't know what Maria is doing. Oh shit, Merman. Yeah, we gotta watch out for them because they will knock us off. Unless you crouch down. Um, if you crouch down and you get hit, you don't go flying like a jerk. You still take damage, but at the same time, you stay in place. So that's good. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, oh. Gotta do um, some dodging there. And I like how that candle is just floating in midair. Suppose if you need a heart. Yep. Castlevania logic. Yeah. <laughs> Candles can go anywhere. Yep, that was the end of uh, stage 2 dash. Oh. Oh. Um, no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm joking. I'm joking. Well, you appear to be Let's next to the Chocolate River for the next stage. Well, we could. <laughs> well, let's go back. Here we are, back where we found the gargoyles. Still cowards. Uh, yeah. Actually, you have to wait, and you have to wait till they kind of like get close to you, and then you can attack them. Because if you try to like go after them or attack them, they fly away, and that's annoying. It's almost as annoying as, once again, seeing another one come by. <laughs> yep. I'm glad they only appear in this level, though. Oh, hey, they can actually attack. <laughs> yeah, I was, I was gonna ask about that. Oh, of but he still goes down menacing, to Menacingly at you? Yeah, pretty much. You know, those gargoyles are actually giving me a ghost and goblins vibe. Yeah. Oh, now, also Maria can slide, <laughs> as you can see. But she can what also double that? jump. <laughs> and... And drown. Yeah. Uh, she dropped like a race. How heavy is this cow? I, I, I don't know. So maybe I was, uh, maybe I was lying that she is the better character, or maybe I just suck with her. Now she. The second theory is proven correct because she is still very broken. <laughs> she also seems to have a double jump. Yep. As you can see, I couldn't do it properly that one time. I was actually going to leave in um, that. Ah. Um, nothing like getting a sword dropped on your head there. No. But, uh, I was gonna leave in the three other deaths that happened. I could not make that jump. <laughs> I couldn't. Impressive. Oh, and hey, look. He drops a one up. How kind. Now, I notice you're using a turtle as your sub left pin. Yeah, the... I don't really make much use of it. Actually, I don't really make much use of any of the sub weapons that she uses that are exclusive to her. But what it does is it makes a dome over you, basically a turtle shell, and yeah. protects you from harm. Also, is this uh, familiar? Oh, it's our good friend the Bone Golem. Hello. 
He's still not very menacing, sorry. Yeah, he's... Yeah. Now is he easier with Maria? Oh well, yeah. Any oh, boss is easier with Maria. She has many, many different ways of dodging. Also, if you hit those bones, they go around. They just move around like they're crazy. Onto the bone dragon? Yeah, pretty much. It's still... Oh, I totally missed. Um, it's still not what I enjoy having to deal with, but hey, at least she can slide out of the way so she can't get hit. Sliding on her belly. Yeah, she's against actually all these a penguin. Bones. That's gotta hurt. She's actually a penguin. I'm demanding someone makes art as Maria as a penguin. To go with Annette Ostrich. Who are you to make demands? Someone train! Part 2. Oh, yeah. This. This is really ridiculous and out of place. I'm... Actually, this is the most ridiculous thing you'll probably see in the game is a 12 year old girl attacking a bone train. I don't know, there's still not a game there. And, well, yeah. I see you rent old John Wu for this ending. <laughs> of course. You can quick save, that's very important. Well, yeah, you can quick save as well. By the way, that also takes you to stage 3 dash prime. 12 year old girl edition. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and for some reason, I thought there was going to be like a record or something over here, but whatever. That skeleton was really determined to get you. <laughs> I know, right? And I'm determined to get him. I could have just, uh, you know, ignored him, but whatever. Speaking of bone dragons, well, previously. Oh, don't worry, you'll see bone dragons soon enough. Now, all these tiny little baby head skull things. Those are, um, I don't know, bone crabs, spider crabs. You know, you know, scutulas from Zelda. Yep. No, no, I think no. these are the... These are the cousins. Yeah, they're the... They're the slightly retarded nephew of the family reunion. The ones that you try to ignore. No, actually the ones that actually are funner to be around. Ah. Uh, the ones that don't start the drama. Is that uh, a turtle? Yes, that was a turtle. I jumped over it. As you can see, my current sub-weapon is a cat. Oh, you're right, it does look like a cat. That's because I it guess. is a cat. <laughs> Sorry that I can't see a little cat screen thing. Yeah, well, guess what? Cat, meet wolf. Let's see how this goes. Oh shit, Kung Fu Werewolf Part 2. Was that the successful sequel to the movie? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> look at him go! <laughs> see, if I... If I remember to use item crashes, you would see the amazing item crash, which is this, is... She summons a tiger. Where does she get the tiger? Can she just spawn animals? Stop yes. using that man. Shut up. <laughs> we... <laughs> Onwards! <laughs>